Hi friends, Zoe here. Or should I be calling you love bugs today? Love bugs or love birds, I'm not sure. I guess birds are probably cuter than bugs, but we love them all the same anyways. So let's get started on some ideas I have for you for Valentine's Day gifts. So I'm going to start off this video by just letting you guys know that this video is being sponsored by Daniel Wellington. They kindly sent me a gorgeous new watch that I'm showcasing for you in this video. I personally believe that watches are a great way to style up a minimalist wardrobe and have you feeling dressed up even when your wardrobe is quite simple. Also, watches are a great gift idea because I don't know about you, but I wear one every single day. And every time I look down on my wrist, I can remember where I got that watch. So if you're giving this as a gift to a significant other, it can be a great way for them to remember you. The watch that I'm wearing is actually in classic black and this is rose gold around it. And the band is not made of leather, so it is vegan. So if there is a vegan lover in your life, you should treat them to a timeless piece such as this because that's where it's at. Next, totally depends on what type of year it is, where you live, but a picnic is always romantic. I can think of a million places in Rome that I would absolutely adore to have a picnic. Same with Toronto, and it doesn't matter where you live in the world because you're either going to have a cool park or piazza in the city, or you're going to have some wilderness to explore. So make a delicious lunch or dinner, and bring along a bottle of champagne, wine, or some tea, and just really enjoy that company with one another. It can create some amazing memories. My next idea, of course I would say something spontaneous, is a spontaneous weekend getaway. Is there a place that you and your partner have been desiring to go for a long time? Maybe it's only an hour away from where you live and you just haven't had the opportunity to go there and explore. Often you can find deals on Groupon for getting a hotel for the weekend. As you both probably have busy schedules, Valentine's Day just gives you an excuse to spend the weekend together and create memories. So why not take advantage of it and plan that trip to that place that you and your significant other have chatted about and desired to go for quite some time now. Get booking. My next idea is a DIY spa night. Okay, who doesn't love to be pampered? So with a DIY spa night, I do them solo all the time, <laughs> but you can either make a base mask or a hair mask from anything that you have around the kitchen or a recipe you find online, or you can go out and buy a face mask or use one that you use on a regular basis. You can give many petties, massages, bubble baths. You can buy some fresh flowers, brew some jasmine tea. I'm going all out here with ideas for you guys. So think about how you could transform, you know, your home, your living room, or your bathroom into a spa, you know, put on that spa playlist. There's got to be something on Spotify like that or on YouTube. So create the spa atmosphere and maybe make dinner for your significant other and just treat them to a nice night in. And this can be a very inexpensive idea as well. So really consider it. I think you can get creative and I think it can be very romantic. My next idea is concert or event tickets. Does your significant other have a favorite band, favorite musician, a favorite artist? Something that you could treat them to if you know that there's an exhibition or a concert coming to town. So this can be a great Valentine's Day gift because you can celebrate the day by spending it together but then also know that you have something in the future to look forward to. So think about your partner and who they really enjoy and if you can grant them the gift of an experience because experiences are wonderful and like I said, it can give everyone something to look forward to. So think about it. My next Valentine's Day gift idea is a journal. A journal is an amazing gift. As you know, I love journals so much and I'll link my journals video below to show you my collection, what I use them all for. But by giving somebody a journal, you're gifting them a gift for them to express themselves. It shows that you care about their thoughts and feelings as that's what they're going to use it for is writing all these things down. So you can make it a memorable journal, maybe write something really sweet at the beginning of it for them, a little note or custom made just for them. You can make a journal really special and like I said, it shows that you care about those person's thoughts and feelings and are allowing them to express themselves creatively. And lastly, as a minimalist, this is something that I definitely, definitely promote is buying somebody that thing that they need. So for example, if your significant other has a broken blender or they have some kind of appliance in their kitchen that doesn't work properly that they're always complaining about that they definitely need an upgrade upgrade them they are going to be over the moon about it and honestly i was that person who literally i told you guys this before i had a magic bullet blender that my roommate got from the side of the road that somebody was giving away and we used that and it sounded like a jackhammer Honestly, it couldn't make smoothies in the morning because I woke up the entire house. So if somebody in your 
life need something like a blender, gift them that. I mean, blender's cool. It could be car fix-ins. It could be just something that they need. You could even get them a gas gift card. And anyways, those are my Valentine's Day gift ideas. Thank you again to Daniel Wellington for glamming me up with this gorgeous watch. And don't forget, I'll leave the links below. You guys can get your significant others or yourself one as well. There is a 15% off discount code and I'm happy to share it with you guys. You need to use that discount code by mid-March, so just make sure that you're, you know, jumping on that deal there. Be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe below if you guys enjoyed this video. Also leave your additional ideas down there. We can all help each other out here. I love you so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.